Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Wednesday the 9th of October 2024. It appears that I've finished my evening online work. I have some more work to be do getting on with but uh, nothing that needs an appointment. And so I shall be playing this game of Sudoku which is the Los Angeles Times Expert Level Puzzle uh, in just a moment. Uh, before I mention something in the news... Uh, it appear, I, I'm not the least bit interested in sport as a spectator. I can't watch anything. Uh, but that wasn't always true. I did love playing tennis and watching tennis when I was young. When I was a teenager, I absolutely adored tennis, both as a player and uh, I love to watch it as well. And I've been to Wimbledon so many times as a spectator, never as a player, of course. Um, and uh, I did love Wimbledon. Uh, and I just noticed uh, in the news that they are going to phase out the line judges. And I think that's a good idea, assuming that the Hawkeye technology that they've been using for many years now at Wimbledon, which I don't watch anymore. I absolutely don't watch anything anymore, any kind of sport. Uh, but that technology is pretty mature now. And I think it's been proved to uh, it's, it's proved its worth. And, you know, human... Uh, Machines are better at doing things like that. High speed bowls are traveling at high speed. Uh, you know, um, machines are better at detecting that kind of thing than humans. Humans, uh, we are not as good as we like to think we are. I can make a song out of that. Um, anyway, so goodbye to the uh, line court judges. Uh, we won't need you anymore at Wimbledon and... Uh, Thank you for your service, but um, go away now and retire. Because most of them are, are like in their 70s or 80s anyway, I think. Or oh, not, not all of them, not most of them, but certainly some of them are. Um, although let's hope they're given some free tickets because Wimbledon tickets, I can't imagine how expensive they are nowadays. Right, let's go on with the game of Sudoku then. A ball game to a number game. Hearing strange noises from outside. Uh, right, start with the sevens in there. Oh, we've also got sixes going up this way and across there. We've got a pair of ones there. Uh, anything else? Oh, a pair of nines. One and nine. Look at that. One and nine there. So we've got ourselves a pair of one and nine there. Look. So what does it mean? Eight blocks down here. Eight is in one of these two squares blocking down. Eight across there. Eight across there. There's our eight. This is one and nine. What else do we know? Uh, I'm not sure. Not sure. One and nine in those squares. Let's have a look here and here then. So we've got one and nine. We're looking for two, three. So threes are up there. Two, three, four, five, I think. Hmm. All right, uh, let's find something else, I think. We've got eight going up here, eight going down here, eight across there. Four blocking across here. So four in one of these two squares blocking down here will give us four in that square. So we'll have fours up here. Fours are there.
I have a feeling we're going to have two five pairs all over the place. I'm not exactly sure yet, but it, it looks like that might be true. Hold on a second. I've seen six and seven across here, six and seven down here. So that's a pair of six and seven in those squares. What else do we know? Threes will be there. Oh, no, they won't. Three blocks across there. Three will be in that square there. Six and seven. So these have to be two, five, nine. We've got nine blocking here, nine blocking there. There's a nine. We've got two and five in these squares here. We've got two blocking there. That's going to be a two. This will be a five. This is a five. Five this way. There's a five. There's a two. We've got six and seven over here. We've got one and two in those squares. And we've got four and six in these squares. So we've got six down here. So there's the six and there's the four. Okay, we've got six blocking those two squares there, six blocking this square, so there's our six for that column. Seven blocking here, seven blocking there, so there's the seven in that column. The last numbers are one and three for that column. I uh, can't seem to get those yet. I think we're going to go through and see what I can see. Ah, so we've got twos there and there. Actually, we've got two and five blocking up there. That's a pair of two and five in those squares there. So this is not two or five. Um, it has to be three and four. Three and four over there. Uh, yeah, of course, two five is like that, isn't it? This is one nine. Yep. So fives. Mm. Okay, let's try again.
six across here and across here gives me a six there, six down there, there's a six, there's a seven. Seven up here, up here, across there and there. Seven across here and there, up there. Seven should be finished, yes. Eight blocking up here and across there and up here. There's an eight. Uh, okay, so we had 2 and 5 in those squares there, so neither of those can be 3. We've got 3 blocking up here, 3 blocking up here, so that has to be a 3 there. Now 3 down here, 3 up there gives us 3 in that square. Three is in one of these two squares down here, so blocking down here, blocking down here, three across here. But when we go in this direction, we see three is either here or here, blocking across there. So that must be our three. This was one and f I'm just going to look at this again. I forgot what this was. This is one and nine, wasn't it? So this is two, four, five. Have we get that yet? Fours are there. Two, five. No, we still can't get that. Ah, we've got uh, a unique rectangle though. We've got two, five in those squares there. This is two, five for sure. This is two, we've got two five blocking up here, right? So two and five in those squares. This is two five because of this column. And it means that this here can't be two or five. Shall we check it out? It's not one, it's not two, it's not three. It could be four, it's not five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so it is a four. Right? Two, five. It's got to be a four. Okay, so then four blocking across here and four up here. We'll put four into that square. So we've got two five two five two five two five up there. Over here we're looking for one and nine. Any help on one or nine? Uh, don't see it. Okay, six and seven are completed digits. Everything else still to be done.
Oh, there's just one number to go up here. How about that? Somehow or another, I missed that. One's across here. There's a one. Uh, I do get this tunnel vision when I'm playing this game. I really do. Uh, nine blocks this square here, so that's going to be our nine. This will be two. Two across here and two up here means this is our two. Now we know that's going to be the five, and we know that's going to be the two, and we know that's going to be the five. Five across here, five across there, there's our five. Five up here, five across there, there's our five. There's one more number to get there, that's a nine, I think. And nine down here, nine across there, there's a nine. Nine this way, there's a nine, this is our one. One blocking up here, here's the one, there's a three. Uh, what's left to get up there? S no, it's not that. Two. Two. Okay, we've also got two blocking across here. That gives us two in that square. Two down there. There's two. Two is finished. Last number here is one. One block's up there. There's one. One is finished. Uh, not much more to go now. There's one digit missing here. That is an eight. We've also got eight blocking across here, giving us an eight there. That's the last eight. Missing number here is a four. Four blocks that way. There's a four. Last number to get there is through. No. Yes. Three. Three blocks across there. There's a three. And this is a five. And that's all over and done. Thanks for joining me. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye.